Happy Wednesday, everybody, and welcome to Show From A Shed, Show From A Shed, welcome to the Show From A Shed, Show From A Shed, Show From A Shed, welcome to the Show From A Shed, Show From A Shed, Show From A Shed, this is my show, this is my shed, Show From A Shed, Show From A Shed, welcome to the Show From The Shed. Hey, you set yourself up there, you get a slightly different view of my shed. Ah, uh, what's going on? Different things, different places. Ah, uh, so, it is Wednesday. Did you all get your toilet roll? Did you chop up your toilet roll? Did you make a big loop? Did it do something unexpected? Ah, uh, so in a minute we're going to explain exactly what happened, what it's called, and what else you can do with it. Okay, so let's move back to the desk. And we'll get back to cutting up toilet paper. What was the secret to the toilet paper? Well, if you look at this carefully, it's not a straightforward loop. What I did is I got, I got nine sections. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's just about long enough. Break those off there. Now, instead of joining them like this, which would make a straightforward loop, I put one twist. So just this end, I fold it over once. And I joined it there. So you can kind of see there's this odd loop in here. Now, this is called a Mobius strip. There's something very special about this. Obviously, when you cut it in half, you see what happens. You end up with one long piece. That's because this only has one side. What do you mean it's only got one side? I can see it's got two sides. But, I'll prove it to you. One second. How do I mean this has only got one side? Watch. If I take a pen, and I start drawing, so I'm going to draw on this side of the paper. Okay, so we draw here, draw here, oops, Draw here. Just using this to draw on this makes it a little bit easier. So I'm drawing one line on one side of the paper. I'm not turning it over. I'm not doing anything else. You can see it's a continual line that I'm just drawing on this piece of paper. Oops. Join that up nicely. Can you see what that is? That should be the other side of the paper. So now I can see that line that comes through here. I'll move this off to the side a little bit. So I've now drawn, without turning it over, on what you would think would be both sides of the toilet roll. But if I've drawn on what we think is both sides of the toilet paper without turning it over, then that can only mean that this piece of paper only has one side. Technically both sides Actually, one side. Mm. When you chop your strip in half, you get one big strip. What happens if you chop that one in half? What happens if you put two twists in the toilet roll and then chop it in half? Little things for you to play with. Enjoy. Be careful with the scissors. Don't waste too much paper. Um, and now it's time for shout outs. Let's go meet Elvis, see what Elvis is up to. <laughs> no, you're gone, Tony. <laughs> no, you Stop doing that. It's no Tony. You. Okay, good. Okay. It's Wednesday. Oh, okay. Oh, who are they going to do birthdays to do? We've got we got a couple of birthdays to do. Who's that? We're going to do David. Oh, hi, David. 
here. Oh, David. Oh, I'm not quite sure. I didn't say. Oh, okay. And Joe. Hi, Joe. Happy birthday, Joe. Happy birthday, Joe. Yeah. Hey, Joe. That's a song. Yeah, yeah we, know, we know it's a song. Oh, okay. Oh, it's a joke time. Yeah, it's a joke time. How did you know I shout out? <laughs> Sorry, we haven't done that for a while, have we? Oh, no. I keep forgetting. Okay, never mind. It's joke time. Okay, it's joke time. How did the first one? Really? Yeah. Okay. What do you call yeah, a monkey at the North Pole? I don't know. What do you call a monkey at the North Pole? Lost. <laughs> lost. I, I like that. That's good. Did you like that? Yeah, I, I did. It's very good. Oh, why is he lost? He like, lives there. Well, no, no, monkeys don't live at the North Pole. Well, why not? Because it's really cold. He could have a nice house with central heating. You, you can't build a house with central heating at the North Pole. No. No, no. It's too, it's too far from everything. Oh, okay. It'd be a really long walk to the shops. Oh, yeah. I didn't think of that. <laughs> Never mind. Okay. You do one. Okay. Why do birds... Yeah. Oh, I like birds. I chase them. <laughs> Another catch them. <laughs> you don't you know. Uh, why do birds... Yeah. Why do they fly south for the winter? Oh, I don't know. Why do birds fly south for the winter? Because it's too far to walk. Oh, yeah. Why? How far are they going? Oh, oh, some birds go a long way. They go thousands of miles, like down to Africa. Oh, that's a long way to walk. It's a long way to fly. It is, it is a long way to fly. I wouldn't do it. I'd take an aeroplane. <laughs> you can't go anywhere on an aeroplane at the moment. Oh, no. What's today's song? Is it another song? Yeah, it's another song. We're doing, we're kind of doing Muppet Week. Oh, I love the Muppets. You do, don't you? Yeah, they're funny. Oh, I don't know who's my favourite. Maybe Ralph should be. He's a dog. Oh, he plays piano. He does play piano. Well, today's song is Rocking Robin. Dude, doodly doo. Oh, I love one too. I, I know you like it. It's your favourite. <laughs> Rocking Robin. <laughs> Are you ready? Yeah. We'll watch it together. I'm going to dance. Okay. Well, you can have a dance. Everyone can have a dance. It's, it's what songs are for. <laughs> okay. And we'll see you tomorrow. See you, everybody. Bye. Oh.